Hi Samuel. Huh? You want to go out? Hey, do you? Trying to get Samuel in one of my videos is a very difficult task. He's usually wanting to escape somewhere. Today he wants to get outside. It's freezing cold out there, but he wants to get out in it. There you go. Yes, I'm free. I'm free at last. That's Samuel. There you go. I try to get him in videos, but he's it's a very unsuccessful endeavor. Anyway, a couple of things have been happening, guys, and I thought I should tell you all the latest. Of course, you'll be, well, hopefully, you're well aware that now I'm, as of today and for the next seven days, so Monday, it's Monday here already in Australia, uh, next seven days until next Sunday, I'm eating soup. So I've got lots of soup. This one's Amy's Chunky Tomato. <laughs> got lots of others I've got a cupboard full of soup up there uh, and yeah so if you feel that you would like to help me do that soup challenge in the description box is the link to the site where you can make your donation to help me achieve some kind of good result for people who can't um, who are not able to look after themselves as well as most of us can. Gee, I hope I can look after myself okay. <laughs> you know what I mean. So that's happening right now and the link is there for you to make donations if you so desire. A couple of other things have happened also and uh, had a really good weekend in the city uh, with some friends and we got around to do some things but anyway that's neither here nor there. I got a bit of gear. I got a got myself a Gorillapod hybrid, little uh, flexible mounting tripod thingy that I can also use as a selfie stick. I've, I'm hanging on at the moment to a monopod, uh, but of course it's only got one length, and uh, I can get it down, take great shots, very handy. But different different things for different reasons. I'll. I'll pull that out of its box and we'll have a look at that in a sec. And I also got this from Aldi. I got a battery, oh, that's very bright. A battery operated portable light, -da, uh, which will just help to balance out some of the light situations that I have every now and again, uh, where, uh, you know, you can have sunlight coming through a window like there. And then I can balance out the light from the other direction, especially here in the kitchen, uh, lots of other places. Um, I could even have that in the car for the car reviews, have it sitting down. I've got to work all that out yet, and I might even get another one yet. So you've got two different directions, but that would work really well in all sorts of different locations. Right, now there's the monopod. It's a Manfrotto monopod that I use to mount just stick the camera up there and, and hold it out there. Uh, that's what I have been using. But from now on, well, I'll, probably, I'll just use both, not from now on, but the the um, Gorilla. So I can have, turn it around that way. That, yeah, that's a bit better. Uh, sort of different situations. Get it out of the box. way too bright just sitting right there I'll get back here how do I get it out of the box I'm on my knees at the moment because I've just sit you guys on the kitchen bench Oop. I'm wrecking the box a few instructions this is the roughest unboxing ever seen on YouTube. Oh, was there something in there? No, it's just packaging. Uh, there you go. A 
So the camera will sit on there. It's got a little level. See the level? And so I'm going to use it like that. Hold it out in front of me like I do with the monopod. Get a good grip. Whack the camera up there. It's got a swivel head on it. And yeah, it goes sideways. Sideways and up and down. And of course, you can separate it. Uh, it takes up to one kilogram. And we've got all the flexibility so I can wrap it around things and hang it off fences, hang it off whatever. Make it makes it a very um, be, being a pliable tripod makes it for makes it suitable for very flexible situations anywhere and everywhere up to a certain point anyway. So there you go. That will be part of my gear from now on. I wonder what that does, that little button there. I just thought I'd better show you what this thing does at the back here. You push the button and the top bit, it's very difficult to do it one-handed but it slides out. So then I can screw that, as many of you would be aware, can screw that down onto the bottom of the camera and that's how, it get, that's how the camera gets fixed to the, the little tripod. So, there you go. I will work it out. I think that's going to be very handy. It takes up to one kilogram, so it'll, really, it'll handle the Sony quite well, uh, or the GoPro, whatever I choose to use on it. Fantastic, I'm very happy about that. Okay, guys, there you go. Back to the main video. I do have to upload on the main channel today a shout-out video, because a reasonable number of people have asked for shout out so i will do that today and uh, several other things happening can't think what they are at the moment but anyway there you go guys samuel is doing more stuff out here look he knows i'm talking about him hello samuel how are you going do you want to say hi to everybody? Hey? <laughs> oh dear, that's Samuel. I've been working in the garage and I've loaded, I've uploaded uh, one, one video about my workbench that I've made. I'm also now going to make a suspended uh, shelf, which I'll make a video about as well. So there'll be a few how-to videos happening over the next week or two and uh, the outside table is set up as a saw bench <laughs> so you can't you, it's too cold out here to eat at the moment anyway do, no outside living at the moment all our livings inside the house so I've set up that table as a workbench to help me achieve the results in the garage that I would like to have anyway guys that's enough for now uh, remember to give me a hand with this soup challenge by clicking on the link below and uh, see what you can do to help me out with your donations. Thanks for watching guys, see you all very soon, bye. Haven't quite finished recording and there's a meowing at the back door so Samuel now wants to come back in. All happening while I'm trying to record a video. There you go. So, there's a whole video about Gorilla Pod, Gorilla Pods and Samuel, and soup.